Oh, look, all, all the way um, through, obviously, on an ongoing basis, all political parties are fundraising. And, of course, on an ongoing basis, we're constantly checking our regime, our protocols, making sure that we're in keeping with expectations. And you'll be doing that in the wake of everything that's going oh, on? We, this this is, th oh, th that's a consistent um, uh, expectation with the party. Um, and that's an expectation I have with our party. Obviously, our party machinery are the ones that operate our fundraising arm, as is the case with all other parties. Did you get it? Well, 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 he is an evergreen tree. He is like Tani Mahuta. Have you ever asked for you a donation to go to the foundation instead of the party? Are you concerned about this? What? No concerns whatsoever. How, follow the process how much do you two know about the foundation? I consider those matters for New Zealand First and indeed the New Zealand First Foundation as opposed to matters for me. There may well be lessons to be learned about the case we're about to see go before the courts involving the National Party. Um, there may well be lessons to be uh, learned about the structure of fundraising. Let's learn those lessons and then let's look to make changes. Minister Mark, will Winston Peter survive this? <sighs> I've got no comment to make at all on uh, the matters relating to the foundation. Have, Have you, you ever asked someone to donate to the foundation instead of the party? I'm not answering any questions around the foundation. When were you first made aware of the New Zealand First Foundation? Well, I won't be answering any questions. Are the two intertwined, the party and the foundation? I have no knowledge. If the SFO does decide to investigate, would it be your expectation that Winston Peters would stand down from his role as Foreign Affairs Minister? Again, uh, that would preempt again a conclusion of those investigations. As I've said, I'm not going to form a view until we have a, a conclusion and outcome, and uh, we simply don't have that yet. So the simple, fact that, he's being, the simple fact that he's being investigated clearly is not enough. Oh, as, as I've said, I'm not going to draw judgment until uh, we've seen a conclusion, uh, an outcome, and we don't have that yet here. Uh, secondly, I'd also point out that we need to be clear about who, uh, in fact, is being involved or uh, uh, is found, if indeed that is the case, to be involved in wrongdoing. Parties structure themselves differently. Not all party leaders are directly involved with uh, fundraising activity. And so, again, that's something not for me to clarify, but for those officials in the appropriate place, such as the Serious Verdict yeah, for Office. Something's been made of the fact that you said that you wouldn't trust, when, or you didn't say you wouldn't trust him, but you no, wouldn't say you trusted him. I actually, I'd say that I don't believe that those, um, uh, that the conclusions there that have been drawn are fair. It, for me, it's implicit. I do. I work with him every day. I couldn't operate this government without a trusting relationship with Winston Peters. Uh, and that is at the core of why we've been able to run that strong, stable government because of that trusting relationship. Then why didn't you say that yesterday? I thought it was implicit in what I said.